environment who can business now. International statistics do not always represent a true picture of the present realities of small businesses in Nigeria. These are the words of an entrepreneurship enthusiast and president of Unique Foundation, Dr. Chris Imomolen, while reacting to the latest report by the World Bank on the ease of doing business in Nigeria. Nigeria has recently moved up to 131 in the World Bank's ease of doing business, ranking from the 146 position it was in 2018. Dr. Chris Imomolen, while giving grants to over 200 Beneficiary says, beyond the challenges of funds, Nigerian entrepreneurs need constant training to sustain their businesses. SMEs in Nigeria, it might not be much. Beyond funding, mentorship programs will be developed so that entrepreneurs can actually know how best to channel this fund and how best to use this fund to empower their business. The people themselves should know that they don't need to rely on grants or funds first to succeed in business. What we need to succeed in business is inherent in us. First, we have to rediscover ourselves. We have to believe in ourselves that we can actually make it work. Once we believe in ourselves, then we have the intuitive knowledge and the capacity to overcome obstacles that surround us. If we wait only for the government to put this right, we might suffer too long to actually actualize our potential. So we believe that. We want to see how we can challenge the people to know that you can do it. While some entrepreneurs relieve their daunting challenges, Dr. Imamolen urges the federal government to endeavor to give grants to genuine small and medium enterprises. I would want to encourage the federal government, to the state and the local government to come out and give people this privilege and benefits which could encourage the youth in improving in businesses like this. My observation, I've been in the business for like four or five years now. So I was initially doing this using my car to go around selling to people, but now I have a shop. So the greatest challenge I have is traveling to source for my goods myself. Because initially I was, I was buying from people that travel. So when they come back, they don't sell to me. You know they won't sell to me at the price they bought. So I don't, much, I don't make that much gain from the sales. What the government is doing now with so many of the investment funds, what we just need is to make it more accessible to the people that actually need it, to remove so many of the bureaucratic bottlenecks that envelops this process. I think when these are done, we'll, we'll, be, we'll be making progress as a nation.